Hey guys, what's going on? Megan here. I finished cooking up my breakfast. Uh, let me show you guys. Here it is. I have my, obviously, my protein following my meal plan. As you can see here, meal one fats, fiber, fruits, no carbs. So I have 20 grams of animal protein, uh, one serving of nuts, some olive oil. For my fiber, I have, that's my fats. For my fiber, I have one serving of crucifers, one serving of bran. And for fruits, citrus, enzymes, red grapes, no carbs. So, I uh, made it quick, I think like 15 or 30 minutes. Have my eggs and uh, the chicken that you, you just saw me making over here. It's actually chicken leg quarters. I took the fat, I trimmed the fat off, kept some of it on there, um, and chopped it up in tiny pieces and kind of sauteed it with some spices, some bell peppers, some onions. So, I have my chicken and my eggs. That's way more than 20 grams of protein. Um, 20 grams is the minimum for me. And I have uh, broccoli for my crucifers, my fiber, a little bit of carrots here to give it some color, some, some flavor. Here I have my fats and my dried nuts. So um, my dried fruits, I mean my dried raisins, my almonds, and my cashews. So that's my healthy fats. I'm gonna put some olive oil on top of that. And I have my fruits, my red grapes, and my oranges. Once again, if you saw my video on the whole testosterone or estrogen thing, uh, Every every single nutrient in here is, is for a reason. Everything here either contributes to a uh, hormonal balance, right? It's not gonna give me a fucking, you know. People think um, when I say testosterone um, boosting foods, I mean something that's gonna jack up your testosterone levels. No, that's not what I'm talking about. It's something that's gonna help balance out your hormone levels, which is very very important when you're trying to lose fat and maintain as much as much muscle as possible. You wanna fix every form of leptin resistance, insulin resistance. Anything that you got from your dirty bug. People forget that when you dirty bug, yes, you make a lot of gains, which I did, but you also have a lot of side effects. Baby, get out the kitchen. No kitchen. No kitchen. But you also get a lot of side effects from dirty bugging. A lot of side effects that you have to fix, guys. People think you just put on a lot of fat, and when you cut, you just lose the fat, and that's it. No, you fuck up a lot of the... Uh, uh, you fuck up your hormonal system when you dirty bugging for too long, which I did. So I'm cleaning, cleaning that up right now with my diet. It's working great. The best way to gauge to see whether your diet is working or not is number one in your brain. If you notice that your mood is changing, you're feeling better, more energetic, uh, your, your sex drive is going up, all these things, it's a good sign that your hormonal balance is, uh, is, has been established. And believe it or not, it takes no more, than, um, no more than four to five days to start seeing results if you're consistent. So anyway, guys, it's my diet for now. I'm about to go get my, my fiber. Add it to this bowl right here, and I'm about to tear it up. All right, guys, stay tuned, stay motivated. Dominance, discipline, direction. I'm out of here. All right, guys. You make my dreams come true. Today's song is going to be Michael Jackson. You rock my word. Four minutes, 25 seconds long. That's how long it's going to take me. You make my dreams come true. You're wasting minutes. <laughs>